welcome to my YouTube channel. Um, today I'm going to be reviewing some American candy. Um, have I done this yet? Yes, the Jolly Rancher review. Make sure you go and watch that one, it seems to be very popular. Um, not sure why, but go and watch it. Um, so I'm going to be reviewing a couple of things today. And I actually haven't tried, uh, maybe the Twizzler I've tried, but I haven't tried the other things. So this will be interesting. The first thing, actually no, I won't show you what they are. I'll just hold them on like this. Um, I've got a sore wisdom tooth today, so my brain's a bit fuzzy. Um, so I do apologise if um, I keep slurring my words or something. I'm in a bit of pain, so I probably shouldn't be eating candy. That's all right. Okay, so the first thing, what to eat first? We'll go to the Twizzler, because I know I don't really like them that much. So at the moment I sell these singly like this, and I also sell them in a small packet as well. Uh, so I'm just opening it, trying to, there we go. That's what it looks like. A bit thinner than a raspberry twist, um, a bit harder as well, and I thought they were hollow but they're not. Tastes like crayon. I knew I didn't like them. It's been a while since I've had one. It's so artificial tasting. It's gross. If you guys, if you really, really like raspberry twists, you probably won't like these. Um, they're definitely not as sweet, but like the texture of it is like crayon. And it's leaving a powdery texture in my mouth. No more of that. Yuck. Ugh. Alright, the next thing I'm going to try is this one because I hate cinnamon. So we'll get that one out of the way. Cinnamon Tic Tacs. Cinnamon Spice. So I'm hoping they're not spicy because I hate cinnamon and I hate spicy things. Um, yeah. Those two things in mind, this could be disastrous, but that's alright. We'll open it. Now, something I learnt, which I didn't know, I think I posted it on my Facebook a while ago. And how the hell you've tipped it? I don't get it. So, there's a little groove on the thing, and you're meant to sit the tic tac in there. But, how are you supposed to do that without tipping them everywhere? Look. How do you. Oh, like that maybe. I don't even know. And then what? You just eat it from the thing? Like, that's stupid. It's just easy to tip it straight into your mouth, don't you reckon? Alright, I'm sucking on it. I don't want to bite straight into it in case it's really hot. It's definitely cinnamon. I'll just bite into it. Oh! Oh! <gasps> yep! Definitely spicy. Oh. <coughs> That's revolting. I'm such a sook. I hate spicy stuff. I feel like I'm eating a cinnamon candle. Oh. I used to make cinnamon candles. And that's just what it tastes like. That's really gross. Yuck. Recommend though if you like cinnamon, but it's so spicy. <sighs> Alright, the next thing to get that horrible taste out of my mouth is the mojito. I think mojitos are sp uh, like, um, not spicy, but sort of really refreshing mint. Now I'm just going to eat it like a normal person. <laughs> Three at once. So they're green and green. I thought they were white, but they're both green. It's definitely alcoholic. I wonder if they've actually got alcohol in them. It does not contain alcohol. There you go. I just need a few more because I've still got cinnamon in my taste, in, um, cinnamon taste in my mouth. Okay, just shove the, 
Maybe I should shove the whole pack in my mouth. them that was a stupid idea um, another stupid idea because now I still have things to try and all I can taste in my mouth is mint I think sometimes they were right um, I think I've had a mojito before Mojito. it's spelt mojito but it's mojito um, yeah no I did like them I, I recommend recommend all right, the next thing, I'm trying to figure out which one to eat that I can actually taste. I'm pretty sure that's bubble gum, so I'm going to try the Mike and Ice. So these are lemonade flavored, um, <coughs> and it's got written on the front: a donation will be made to Alexa's Lemonade Stand Foundation for Childhood Cancer. Oh, please, do it. right. So much mint. Oh wow, they look different to what I thought they were. Hang on, I'll pull out. So they're sort of a capsule <coughs> looking thing. Chewy. A little bit sour. A little bit sour. Orange one. All I can taste is mint, so I don't really know. It was a really dumb idea, but what can you do? I'm trying to find a pink one. Ah, here. Yeah. Mmm, yum! What flavour is that? It says on the packet, Chewy lemonade flavoured candies, naturally and artificially flavoured. Naturally? Really? I don't think so. Eat two, by the way. So if you're a celiac, you can eat these. Or if you're one of those people that don't like eating gluten. Alright, I'm going to try a green one. It's the last one. I think it's lime, maybe apple. Not really on top of my flavours today. <laughs> Just I need this wisdom tooth. It's really just put me off. All right, the last thing I'm going to try is the wasn't upside down. The icebreaker sours. Now I'm not a huge fan of sour stuff. We'll add that to the list as well. I've got this uh, ever-growing list of things that I don't like. Um, how do I open this? That's got plastic around it. That's why I couldn't open it. Just put plastic in my hair. Oh, good. How do I get in? Here we go. All right, so these are sugar-free. And there's green apple, watermelon, tangerine, natural and artificial flavors all right so i'm gonna open them maybe oh why is there to share not to share i don't get it it's got two little groovy bits that one opens and then this one just doesn't. Ah, okay, got it. I still, I just, okay. Ah, oh, yum, they smell really good. Ah, oh, they look like a Panadol tablet. <laughs> look like Panadol, look. But with little speckles in it. I don't know if you can see it. How 
weird. Like it feels like I'm about to eat a Panadol. Is that weird? Ow! I thought these were meant to be bubblegum. Maybe. It actually doesn't say on there that they are. I actually had a customer contact me and say that her and her friend bought a packet each and one were bubblegum and one weren't. So may but maybe. It was sour. <coughs> it's like sour tangerine. I'm going to research. Um, I did contact the company when my customer told me about the fact that some turned to gum and some didn't. So I'm going to research and actually find out what the go is because these aren't. So these are actually made by the Hershey company. Um, just trying to find what else I can tell you guys about them. They are sugar free, they're made with sorbitol as a sugar substitute. And they're actually really, really sweet for sugar free. Um, probably one of the sweeter things I've had of sugar free before. I actually don't mind these. I didn't like the tanger tangerine one though. It was too, too sour. <laughs> too sour. Alright, so I'm going to sum up the review. Um, as I do. Um, what was my favourite? <sighs> probably the Mike and Ike's. Um, they were a bit hard to taste because I had such a strong mint flavour in my mouth. But I do like the texture of these, quite chewy. Um, <coughs> and <coughs> they do taste, they do, okay, I'll give them credit. They do taste healthy, um, as in natural flavourings in there. I do like them. Probably, sorry, I keep getting sidetracked. I keep reading as I'm talking and then I... Yep. Um, what would I rate these? Probably, I'd give them a 7 out of 10. The next thing would probably have to be the Mojito Tic Tacs. I don't know why I say it like that. Mojito Loser. Um, yep. I really like them, but probably not nearly a whole packet. Look how many I ate. I shoved them all in my mouth. <laughs> probably not that many at once. Um, I'd probably give them a 8 out of 10. Yep. Um, the next would be the icebreakers. It's hard to say because I don't really like sour stuff that much. Um, I did like the flavour though and I do like the texture and that type of candy. So they're sort of like a chalky type of candy. Um, let's go a 6 out of 10 for those. Alright, the next would probably be the Twizzler. Um, mm, I didn't like it that much. I don't know, it's hard. I guess you guys probably have to try one to know what it's really like. But very crayon-y, very crayon. I've never eaten a crayon before, but if I was, I'm pretty sure it was, to, if I was to eat one, I'm pretty sure it would taste like this. Um, just like a powdery, dry, I don't know, oily, Oily and dry go against each other, but I don't know. Just eat one, you'll find out what I'm talking about. Um, and then the cinnamon. Definitely. Oh, I didn't rate that. Probably a 2 out of 10. Um, and the cinnamon spice Tic Tacs. Definitely a 1 out of 10. Hate spicy. Hate cinnamon. Sorry, Tic Tacs, but I don't like this flavour. Um, but definitely, if you like cinnamon and spicy stuff, then you'll like these. Um, so all of these things are on my website. I will put a link below so you can check them out. Yeah, so if you guys give me a thumbs up, that'd be cool. Thanks. Thanks for watching, guys.